Hello everybody and welcome back to the Weasel Wars server for the big finale as the title says and I'm of course here with Mr. Nemsum. Mr. T, sucker. <laughs> Mr. T. Okay. I ain't going on no plane. <laughs> How you doing? Yeah, I'm fine. Uh, we were working like crazy. So yeah. this is what we got. This and is like a few hours work this, isn't it? Uh, it's not only a few hours, it's yeah, almost yeah. a few days. <laughs> a few days, yeah. yeah. So what you see here are ICBM missile launchers. And uh, with this launchers, we want to show our strength to the server. I guess we won't destroy the whole world, of course. But what we will do is uh, yeah, show that we are here, that we are ready to fight whenever it comes to a point that somebody has the same strength as we do. And you can see Nemson there loading the rockets in. But uh, for us this will be the big finale since after we are launching this rockets we will um, go to our silo which won't be hit by any rocket and launch off into the uh, orbit and start a space station there so we are safe and secure because nobody can get to a space station. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. Uh, you can make a space station that nobody can hit, nobody can access, nobody can get to, uh, and this is a war server. Yep. It's a strange combination, really. So we can have a completely safe place to store all our stuff where we can't be raided, can't be destroyed, can't have anything negative happen to us, and just wait it out until the others either catch up and the uh, server starts being something worth being a series, uh, or it doesn't. And we've got all our stuff safe anyway. We had a lot of fun, of course. Especially mm -hmm. I had a lot of fun. Uh, you teaching me how to play with mods. But I had a bit the feeling that this is not the way I should learn the mods. Since I'm completely new to mods and playing on a war server, rushing through different mods. We w were doing ICBM, Galactic Craft. Um, I saw a bit of Tinker's Construct. I, uh, what else was there? Um, can't even remember well, the names. Well, plenty of thermal expansion been yeah, doing thermal as well. expansion and of course computer craft. These are yep. so many mods and I should really focus on just a tiny bit maybe and understand it better. So I will continue with modern Minecraft since I'm having fun with that, but in another way, not on a war server. And um, yeah, you of course have your Utopia series. Uh, yeah, I have been neglecting my Utopia while I've been hammering this to get uh, as far as we could because I was expecting to do lots of fighting and lots of war that never really happened. Uh, we had a bit of a fight with Juicy, which was a bit of fun. Um, Talk for a laugh. about Juicy. Have you seen him lately? Have I seen him lately? Yeah. <laughs> you, got, you got his morph because you killed him. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I just realized. I'm yeah. Juicy Pixel. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I've totally forgot where I was. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we are setting up all these missiles to destroy huge areas in a show of strength so that when we leave this server to go on to Utopia and do modded Minecraft at a nice leisurely pace and I can continue with my hard work on there um, I, I never really could afford the time to do another series of modded Minecraft I've got my Utopia series and I've got my single player series and I've had to uh, convince myself to come and join this server because of my VisoCraft friends on here and uh, quite a lot of them didn't really feel the interest in playing mm -hmm. modded Minecraft. They're sticking to VisoCraft, uh, which is all fair enough. But it means that this series doesn't really have a lot of legs on it. It doesn't really have a lot going for it. So we're having a, a big stint, as you've seen this week, where I've just been uh, hammering out videos. Uh, and now we're having the grand finale, and then it's all over until something 
else happens, maybe, or we just stick to what I know best, going back to Utopia and carrying on with modded Minecraft on there. Carrying Keeping on with the my memory projects. of this project. Uh, it's been a fun mini series. We knew it was going to be something like a mini series when we started out. Yeah, we told you in the beginning. I can definitely remember that. Mm -hmm. So it is a mini series in the end. And it was fun. I really enjoyed it. Yep, your and first look at mods. And I think you have been fairly successful in getting to grips with things very quickly. Uh, the the show of strength that we have here is a combined effort, not just me. We've both been working really hard. Uh, Peddy has had turtles digging for hours, and we've got all the resources we needed to make tons and tons of these. Uh, ev just to put it into perspective, um, every single control panel that goes with a, rock, a missile here, and every single launch platform that goes with a missile here, and every single missile that goes here uh, needed a block of iron and quite a lot of redstone because of the circuitry that's involved. So we have ground out this server in order to get all of the materials we needed to make this huge array. It's pretty much a stack of rockets, a stack of missiles. Uh, it's quite an epic feat, I believe. Um, Lots and lots and lots of materials have gone into the production here, and we just spent a few hours crafting and getting it all set up for this huge launch. So, uh, I think we're about ready, aren't we, Petty? Yes, we are. I have two rockets left, and searching for the rocket stands. I think I had a couple spare, just in case anything happened, <laughs> like glitches with rockets on top yeah. of rockets and things like that, or any misfires or anything. Just in case. So I guess that we will for now stop talking. We should go and clean up our base and get out of here ready for these rockets to fire. Yeah, and then enjoy a clip of these rockets going off. Kaboom, kaboom, kaboom. Alright guys, see you in a little bit. Okay then, Peddy. We've got to dismantle this base quick before those missiles uh, destroy things all over the place and make the whole world useless. Should be uh, set up so nothing hits this place. I hope that I got the coordinates <laughs> right. I hope you got the coordinates right <laughs> as well. So we should be able to just uh, right-click with the wrench all of the strong boxes, scoop all these things up and dump them into other strong boxes, and then everything goes with us into the strong boxes should work uh, in theory I think I've got it all set up that way and then everything can go into an ender chest and we've got everything with us in our next future endeavor Ooh. there we go 
you just broke that strong box it while I was there, didn't you? Oops. <laughs> you broke a strong box while I was filling it. So we got it. Uh, I want to take these things as well. I want to take all this. I want to take all this. I want to take that. I want to take everything that we may possibly need in the future. I'll uh, take all that. Not that there's going to be much of a future. I mean, uh, we've got it sorted now so that we are just uh, OP when it comes down to this server. And everybody else should just beware and watch out for us coming back. Indeed. So if in, in any time everybody is ready to yeah deal with what you just saw a moment ago, they can come. We will be here again. But yeah, other than that, I guess uh, we'll pause a while here. Well, we can uh, jump straight into our ship and go from here, can't we? Yeah, of course we can. So we are always ready. Yeah, I've pretty much got everything out of here that I think we need. The farms and stuff will be okay to stay, I guess. And let's just load this last load into storage and I will be ready to go everything into my under chest that I don't want on me right now I'm gonna take a sword though because those are uh, mobs they're ridiculous up there oh yeah okay and jump out okay so prepare for launch we got everything we've got the fuel we've got yep. our parachutes, oxygen sorted oxygen. parachutes okay okay so should we I'm do it at the same time we have got this ceiling open as well, and we you did that, yeah? I will go into the mode where I'm inside the rocket so I can watch out of the little hole. Okay. Okay, so... Let's three, go. Two, one... Go! Oh, it's shaking a bit. I hope we can 15. both get out at the same time. I can see you there. I can see your name tag. Yeah, I can see yours too. Being realistic, not using F5 for now. <laughs> Goodbye, world. Maybe Goodbye, we'll see you back. Goodbye, server. Oh, you're off. I see you going. Yeah, I see you going too. I'm next. I'm coming. You're down there. Wow! I can see flames flashing below my feet. That's not good, is it? No, it's not. <laughs> oh. Oh, and now we see the uh, planet beneath us. Mm -hmm. And that's it. Yeah. I guess that's it for the series. I hope you all enjoyed it. We did. I'm glad you learned a few things and you're into mods now, Paddy. Yeah, and we'll do some more modded stuff. In well, the you future. have to come over to the Utopia server and bring uh, Rike uh, Rik with you. Yeah, we and will then come. Do, do some stuff over on the Utopia server. Get you a nice, steady introduction into mods instead of this rush into war and trying to kill everybody. Indeed. And it gets quiet, so I guess that's it. That's it. All that's left is for the base to explode now we've left. And, see uh, you later. See you later, guys. Bye.